Last name ever, first name greatest Like a sprained ankle, boy, I ain't nothing to play with Started off local, but thanks to all the haters I know G4 pilots on a first name basis What's going on guys, d here bringing you guys another Madden 16 defensive Nano Blitz. This is actually going to be an extremely quick and easy B-gap pressure that you're able to get out of your linebacker with pretty good run defense as well. Like anything up the middle or inside zones and things like that will get stopped by this defense. So the play is going to be the Fire Zone 3. This was sent to me by VD, whose YouTube channel will be in the description below with this Blitz video. But like I said, play is Fire Zone 3. What you want to do is you want to base the line. You want to show Blitz. You want to crash your defensive line to the left. And then the guy that you're using, this middle linebacker, just throw him on a QB spy. Stand right next to your DT. You have to re-blitz this DT, by the way. Re-blitz that DT, pass commit while standing in this spot. And you guys will be able to see that you're able to get some nice B-gap pressure there from your right of screen defensive lineman now once you see that this blitz is coming in as i say all the time you don't need to sit there and stand in that spot the entire time hovering you could just move off of that spot at any given time um, to make sure that that blitz does get in but like i said it's going to shoot through that b gap just about every single time so again uh, we're going to pass commit and then we're going to be standing right in this spot right here guys you guys are able to see that time we got an even faster b gap out of our linebacker there like i said it's extremely easy to do guys it's a very basic blitz for you guys to send in with some really nice b gap pressure and that's obviously what i like about it is it's easy to set up and you get nice pressure so fire zone three base align show blitz you want to shift you want to crash your defensive lineman to left you want to re-blitz this dt even move them over one step as well if you can i think that's actually what got in the pressure we got in last time QB spy this defensive guy right here and you guys are able to see right there he got caught up but we were able to get the B gap from him he did just obviously get caught up but we're gonna send this again like I said you guys want to put in your fastest player on your left of like your left end or your left or your right of screen defensive lineman and even your fastest linebacker in that spot as well um, not really I mean it's going to come in consistent regardless but that way, if you set it up like that, you're actually going to be able to get in a little bit faster. So again, 4-6 normal, fire zone 3. What you want to do is base a line. You want to show blitz, crash your defensive lineman to the left. And then what you want to do is re-blitz this DT right here. Take this middle linebacker right here, throw him on a QB spy. And then just stand right next to this defensive tackle right here. And you guys are able to see that time we're able to get the edge pressure from our linebacker like I said very very easy let me just run it one more time for you guys pretty slowly just so you guys are able to get down the steps as easy as I am but like I said four six normal guys you guys can throw in the speed package as well to get it in a little bit quicker I'll do that and then like I said inside uh, it's gonna be fire blitz or fire zone three base align wire triangle and right on the d-pad crash your defensive lineman to the left so your left bumper and left on the right joystick show blitz your wire your triangle button and left on the d-pad and then what you want to do is re-blitz this defensive end right here so a or x and then down on the right joystick back to the left hold on to this guy i don't think it's necessary to qb spine but if you want to you can um hold left trigger right here press right up on your right joystick so that's on a pass commit hold your left uh hold right here and then you guys are able to see besides him getting caught up on the guy you're able to get easy b gap pressure or right of screen defensive end pressure like i said if i'm struggling against it the cool thing is you guys also have vd to go to his channel and take a look at what he has uh, because he has it a little bit easier so like i said it is a little bit easier to set up than what i'm making it out to be but like i said it's a really easy blitz guys for some b gap or right of screen edge pressure very easy to set up baseline show blitz crash to the left re-blitz the guy and then hover very very easy to do to get nice easy consistent b gap pressure so i hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to leave a like comment and subscribe and if you haven't already don't forget to follow me on twitter and as always, guys, this is the money, and I'm out. Base the line. You want to show blitz. You want to crash your defensive line to the left. And then the guy that you're using, this middle linebacker, just throw him on a QB spy. 
stand right next to your DT. You have to re-blitz this DT, by the way. Re-blitz that DT, pass commit while standing in this spot. And you guys will be able to see that you're able to get some nice B-gap pressure there from your right of screen defensive lineman. Now, once you see that this blitz is coming in, as I say all the time, you don't need to sit there and stand in that spot the entire time hovering. You could just move off of that spot at any given time um, to make sure that that blitz does get in. But like I said, it's going to shoot through that B gap just about every single time. So, uh, but we're gonna send this again. Like I said, you guys want to put in your fastest player on your left of like your left end or your left or your right of screen defensive lineman, and even your fastest linebacker in that spot as well. Um, not really. I mean, it's going to come in consistent regardless. But that way, if you set it up like that, you're actually going to be able to get in a little bit faster. So again, four six normal fire zone three. What you want to do is base a line. You want to show blitz, crash your defensive lineman to the left. And then what you want to do is re-blitz this DT right here. Take this middle linebacker right here, throw him on a QB spy, and then just stand right next to this defensive tackle right here. And you guys are able to, again, uh, we're going to pass commit, and then we're going to be standing right in this spot right here, guys. And you guys are able to see that time we got an even faster B-gap out of our linebacker there. Like I said, it's extremely easy to do, guys. It's a very basic blitz for you guys to send in with some really nice B gap pressure. And that's obviously what I like about it is it's easy to set up and you get nice pressure. So fire zone three, base align, show blitz. You wanna shift, you wanna crash your defensive lineman to left. You wanna re-blitz this DT, even move them over one step as well if you can. I think that's actually what got in the pressure we got in last time. QB spy this defensive guy right here and you guys are able to see right there he got caught up but we were able to get the B gap from him he did just obviously get caught up to see that time we were able to get the edge pressure from our linebacker like I said very very easy let me just run it one more time for you guys pretty slowly just so you guys are able to get down the steps as easy as I am but like I said, 4-6 normal guys you guys can throw in the speed package as well to get it in a little bit quicker I'll do that and then, like I said, inside, uh, it's going to be fire blitz or fire zone three, base align, wire triangle, and right on the D-pad. Crash your defensive lineman to the left, so your left bumper and left on the right joystick. Show blitz, your wire, your triangle button, and left on the D-pad. And then what you want to do is re-blitz this defensive end right here, so A or X, and then down on the right joystick. Last name ever, first name greatest. Like a sprained ankle, boy, I ain't nothing to play with. Started off local, but thanks to all the haters, I know G4 pilots on a first name basis. What's going on, guys? Do you want to hear bringing you guys another Madden 16 defensive nano blitz? This is actually going to be an extremely quick and easy B gap pressure that you're able to get out of your linebacker with pretty good run defense as well. Like anything up the middle or inside zones and things like that will get stopped by this defense. So the play is going to be the fire zone three. This was sent to me by VD, whose YouTube channel will be in the description below with this blitz video. But like I said, play is fire zone three. What you wanna do is you wanna base